Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another fun project for my Comgro Z1 laser cutter. So let's get cracking. Alrighty, friends. So first things first, I have created a new system. You'll see these pieces of plastic. They sit underneath the feet so that way I can hold down my cardboard and I'm absolutely digging how these are turning out. I am making a new version that is totally under the foot. There will be a link to this file if you want to 3D print it. Friends, these are wires that are used for hanging insulation. They've got a nice amount of tension and I'm loving how they work with the laser. So friends, once again, we are in Lightburn. I have got the camera connected on this one. So you can see right there, that is my piece of cardboard. If we hit update overlay, it'll show up over here. So you can see where the design is. Notice there is a cutout in this piece of cardboard so I can actually move it to where I want. We're gonna do file import and we're gonna bring in something I call Laser Cut Lenny. Now this is a fun Tinkercad project. You can see because of the camera, we can drag this exactly where we want. It is super simple. And then of course I have got the laser connected. It's on COM10. Real quickly, let's check the settings. We are gonna be doing 400 speed, one pass, and 100% power. All right, so let me give you the view of both here. We will hit frame. You can see now it is using absolute coordinates. It is moving out to the correct location. It just ran into that spot, so I'm gonna nudge it a little bit more to the right. I'm also going to take this part, and because of the shape of my cardboard, I'm gonna move it down below. Let's tuck that in there, and then also, I found out I already cut this once. This is too high. Another nice thing is we can choose tools nodes. I can real easily select those two nodes and I can just pull them straight down. That is going to be a lot more slick. I'm going to do the same thing over here. Once again, I'm going to click on the shape. Let's choose tools. Let's do edit nodes. So friends, I'm going to go from the right to the left. Grab those two nodes and I'm going to just pull them straight in a little bit. And then this will notch a lot better when we're done. So friends, let's quickly hit frame. We did run into my little hook, but check this out. I will just adjust the hook to another spot. It's that slick. The system is not permanently locked in place. I can just move them. Let's frame it one more time and see what it looks like. And that I do like. So friends, I'm going to now close the enclosure. And of course I am grabbing my laser protection. Let's just start to make something magical. Alrighty friends, so let's dive in and see what we built. Once again, I can easily move the wires out of the way, pull out the design, and friends, this is my Tinkercad cardboard character created on an iPad and that little arm piece. And laser cut Lenny is complete. How fun is that? All right, everybody, so check it out. The stand slides in just like that, and boom, Laser Cut Lenny is ready to stand up. How fun is that? Totally created in Tinkercad using an iPad. Fun, fast, and it's turning out pretty darn sweet. Friends, these are the insulation supports. Uh, I got these for putting insulation in the basement. And there's a bunch left over, and bingo, now we found a cool use for them. 
All right, everybody, so once again, the Comgro Z1 absolutely crushed this fun tutorial. Friends, if you're looking for more information about the Z1 or the suite enclosures, there will, of course, be links down below. Of course, friends, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Of course, friends, don't forget you totally make my day if you take time to leave a comment down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when this brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.